Alrighty guys. Back again, solo hike. See what I can come up with. Just came out here with the wife and son. Ah, a little boy is crying for me. He wanted to come with me, I told him we can't. Going far away into this uh, brushy areas. Okay. I'll see what I can pick up for you guys. Uh, if anything, I'll get back to you. But thinking about walking further back in here all the way to the back and then from the back make my way up and around and back down and come back up but if ending uh, yeah, get back with you guys once I pick up something or come across something Alright, peace. Alright you guys, update. Following this elk trail. Goes all the way up this way. And came in on this one. Hard white. Last year's, so I'll say. That's better than nothing. So I'm gonna continue making this. Uh Hitting this trail, see what I can find. Got a good um missing what deep country there. But uh fending. I'll get back to you. Um my plan was to go right up there on that hillside, but uh I would say it'll be easy to come down the top, come down and then zigzag or whatever come back up then because there's a road on top too but uh i'll see what i can find um in this area make my way up to the top go to that saddle and then dive down the other side zigzag back out and then side slope it all the way back out i'll see how long how long it'll take me to get on top and over uh, once i get on top and over i should be good from there on out it'll be all downhill but uh, if I get another one, I'll get you guys back on. Alrighty, peace. Alrighty, guys, another update. I was following this elk trail, and that one that goes up, I was gonna go up that way. But as I went up, I came across a brownie spotted out from the top down on this elk trail. There's a lot of elk trails in here. And I'm kind of way further back in these drainages here. But there it is. Thank you, Jesus. Raghorn, but I'll take it all day long. Awesome. See, for the pickup. Study that there. Bam. There it is, guys. It's been chewed for a little bit. Let's see the bloody bases. All right. This is a good plan. Coming along here. Going around. I might uh, head up from here. Kind of zigzag. Make my way up. See if I can pull. Um, hopefully I get blessed with another brownie or two or three or more. But these are elk trails all around. I'll just continue making my way up this one. And see what I come up with on the other side there. Yeah. All right, good. But uh, I'll get you guys back on. Um, if I come up on another brownie, hard white, or whatever. But like I said, my goal was to go to that uh, bowl in there. But um, I decided just to kind of dive off from that top and then come down and then pick up that uh hard white it looks like a hard white from a glass from all the way across but check out this country i'm dealing with it's pretty good it's fun walking around out here um you know like i said i'm solo hike today uh, i usually come out with one of my buddies 
uh, I, I left late, left about uh, noon, came in here, say it's about three o'clock now, and I'm further back into the wilderness. But once I uh, get up to the top, like I said, it'll be downhill, back out to the truck there. But um, I'll get you guys back on once I get back on this uh, journey here. All right, stay blessed. Thank you, Jesus. All righty. See you guys in the next video there. All right, guys, update. So I made it to the top of the saddle. There's a lot of trails dropping. Okay. But this ridge goes all the way up. It'll take you to uh, um, the top dry lake and a uh, old summit trail, old summit road. But this is what we got. What we're dealing with. It's a lot of country there. good to run around and you, know, you just gotta have that strength when you're coming out here uh, it's all in the mind you know just keep going pushing yourself hiking up hills uh, if you do a lot of zigzagging you're gonna burn yourself out or if you walk fast you burn yourself out too Best bet is just kind of take your time, cruise it up, look around you, look in front of you, look inside of you, look all around you when you're hiking these brush. You never know, you might pass a rack, a shed, just like me down there on the bottom. I almost uh, passed it. Lucky I looked to my side and there, there it was down on the bottom. So I had to go back down and pick it up. But a good uh, deal though good to be out here um, you know, it's good to look at this country a good country there's that side and this is the other side of the country see that good area Uh, a couple of days, the second day I walked in that ridge, I came down, all the way down to the bottom. And that road's way at that side, that's from uh, Dry Lake. And this is usually be, usually used to be an old road right here, but uh, I think they stopped uh, working it and they just kind of let it go. But yeah, this is what I got, guys. Um, Let's give you an update on made it to the top. So I'm gonna dive down and make my way back around, see what I come up with. Uh, hopefully I get something. If not, you know, these guys are cool, you know, whatever I got. But I'll see you guys on the next pickup. If not, I'll definitely end the video and then um headed out then. So we'll see you guys on the next round. But Stay tuned for another pickup once I go back down this hill. Peace. Alrighty guys, update. Just dive down the hill, walking this elk trail. And look what I came up on. Chalky. We'll take them. Right. <clears throat> oh. There it is. Good. Turn around. I'm gonna make my way down. There's a good rubbing. You know, a lot of signs in here. All right, thank you, Jesus. Got three, three sheds all together. Plus this, with this guy. Put it on the pack and continue making my way down.
Peace. See you guys next round. Alrighty, guys. Thanks for watching. This is going to be it. The last of the hills I came out of. Uh, but I'll make my way out to the truck. This is all I found. One brown, one hard white, and one chalk. But I'm um, collecting all the antlers. Whatever I get, whatever I find, I'll throw them in my pack. So it starts to get the heavy, then I'll maybe drop some or stash them and then come back and get it. But uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I heard some people in here. I'm not sure who it was. Heard someone yelling when I was up on the top there, yelling down here in the bottom. I figured they probably came across a bear or something. Or I might have just been tripping out and walking through the brush. But um, for example, I usually just do a loud clapping noise instead of yelling. You know, just a loud clapping noise and walk through it and then continue on. But I'm glad I found the brown. I'm blessed with the brown, but it's, and I'm blessed of what I what I got in my bag. But um, thank you guys for watching. Um, we'll see you guys on the next adventure <laughs> let's call it that shed hunt peace